Today I'm going to show you how to change the ring time system-wide and also how to change the ring time on an individual user's phone via the manager program. So once you've logged into the system, it'll bring you right to the system tab. You'll see these three fields pop up. This just tells you the name of the system. And then on the right hand side, it gives you all the information of the system. So what we're going to do is we're going to locate the telephony tab, and that's the tab where you can change the ring time system-wide. So I'm going to click on telephony once. Once I left click over to telephony, you'll see um, all the information on the telephony tab here. And what we're trying to do is we're going to find the, how to change the ring time on each user's phone. The first thing I want to show you is right here in the middle it says default no answer time and that's set at 15 seconds. So this is actually, this is set system wide. So right now if I'm just building a new system and I just implemented this, everybody's phone is going to ring for 15 seconds. That's about three rings. After it rings for 15 seconds it will go out to that person's voicemail. If you wanted to change that, if you wanted everyone to have a 20 second, 20 second ring time or a 25 second ring time, you would just simply highlight over that number and then type in the new ring time that you want. Once you've typed in the new ring time, you press OK at the bottom of the screen. And then to make that live in the system, you go to the blue disk up here or you can go to File, Save Configuration. Now, say you wanted to change the default no answer time to 20 seconds for everybody in the company, but you had a couple of users that said, you know what, I really want mine at 15 seconds. I don't like the 20 second ring. You can change that per user, and whatever you change on the user tab will override the system tab here. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to go to the user tab. So we're going to go back over to our configuration tree on the left hand side and look down till we find user. We'll click on, left click on the user here. And then we're going to click on the user who wants a longer ring time. So say extension 205 wants their ring time to be longer or shorter. So we click on the user here, 205. And we're going to go to that user's telephony tab. Just like we did the telephony tab under the system tab, we're going to do the telephony tab under the user tab. I'm going to left click once on telephony. And then I'm going to find this user's no answer time. And if you look right now, since we just set it to, this, to 20, you'll see right here it says no answer time, system default 20. But we want to do is we want to change this to 15 seconds. So. Um, I'm going to highlight over this, this system default and type in 15 because this user wants it to ring a shorter amount of time. So I uh, type in 15, press OK at the bottom of the screen, and then to make this live in the system, I go to the blue disk on the left, upper left hand side, or I can go to File, Save Configuration. And now this user will have a no answer time of 15 seconds and everyone else will still have 20 until you change it. Again, the no answer time um, on this users tab will override whatever the system tab says. And that's how you change the ring time via the manager program.